We are going to um, we are going to move into congregational prayer at this time. Uh, a couple of updates. Uh, one is that Oliver is continuing to do very well in many respects. He is having some struggles with digestion, right? Um, and so um, the prayer is that he just needs some time. Uh, for those organs to develop properly and that everything given some time will be fine. Um, and uh, certainly it, the, there have been so many answers to prayer in this whole, uh, this whole process. But please continue to pray for Oliver um, as well. Uh, also, uh, please continue to pray for Belinda. Uh, Belinda is, and the baby uh, there are, are doing well. They are still, as far as I know, unless somebody can correct me, last time I saw they're still together. I mean, literally together. And uh, so that's a good thing. So um, she is getting all the bed rest she needs, um, maybe a bit more than she wants, probably wants to get out and about. Um, and John and the kids at home are doing well. Um, but please continue to pray for Belinda as well. Yeah. Ooh, neat. Inducing her on Tuesday. Excellent. Okay, that is good, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so she will have meet, she will have achieved the finish line, as it were. Yeah, that's wonderful. Thank you. I was hoping somebody would give me an update. Uh, good. So uh, pray for that as well. Good. And then uh, also Alan, um, as you know, Alan had uh, had had some heart stuff, and that is. That is continuing to go really well. His pacemaker is working well, and that's great. And so he is slated, hopefully, to have his cataracts done um, Tuesday as well. Yeah, good. So uh, Alan will hopefully have his cataracts done, and that will be great for both Aki and Alan, I'm sure. Our offering today is for Heritage Community Christian School. Um, you can always check out their website to find out more about what things are going on. Uh, but things continue to go uh, very well, although somewhat unusually. Although they're pretty smooth here nowadays, pretty much. Yeah, it's good. So the offering plate will be at the back uh, for you at the end of the service. Let us pray. Father in heaven, thank you so very much for this day again. Lord, we pray that you will guide us as we come to uh, your word for the message this morning. We thank you so much that we have had the opportunity to hear you speak in scripture and prayer and song already this morning. And we ask that you would continue to speak through your Holy Spirit, that the communion of which we partook, that the baptism which we share would go with us as your Holy Spirit walks with us throughout this week, that we may truly know the hope of Jesus in our lives, and that we may share that hope wherever we go. Father in heaven, we pray especially this morning for uh, little Oliver. We ask that you will be with his parents, Brian and Jody. Lord, that you will uh, care for them and uh, help them. Uh, Lord, thank you so much for the hope that they already have. Lord, we pray that you will also be with Belinda and with John and with the baby and the kids. Lord, we thank you so very much that things are going well there as well. We ask that uh, you would help the baby to hold on for just a, a couple more days uh, and that uh, the induction and everything would go uh, just fantastically well. Father, we pray for all our families who may be struggling uh, with COVID or just with uh, life in general. Uh, Lord, these are unusual times, and we ask that uh, you would support our families, not just our families with young kids, although, yes, them too very much, but also our families of any age, O oh God. Lord, we think as well of those families in which one or more of the people uh, cannot get out and about as much anymore. We ask that you will be with them. Lord, in particular, 
Uh, we, think of, we think of Frank, Lord, and we think of uh, Dorothy, and Lord, we, th- we think of Wayne and Sherry, Lord, we think of, uh, we think of Hank, uh, who is with us here today, Lord, we think of, uh, we think of Lita, Hoving, uh, Lord, uh, we just ask that you will be with Henny and Mark, oh God. Father, we pray that you will be with Pete and Hinka. And Lord, would you please comfort and strengthen each of them. Lord, we ask as well that you would be with all those in our village who cannot get out and about as they might like to. We pray that the annual Christmas dinner may be a wonderful thing. And we pray that uh, people will be encouraged by being able to receive that meal. Father, we pray as well that you will be with the Christmas hamper a project that the, the food bank participates in and, and leads every year. Lord, guide them and keep them too. May this Christmas, though as Cole mentioned, may be different, may this Christmas be wonderful and pleasing in your sight, and may it also encourage and strengthen each person. In Jesus' name, amen.